call to business is not a gathering or seminars only, but it's really a people in the marketplace meeting together and hopefully can connect one another, establishing partnership, do the business together to glorify God, and we use all of the resources to bring impacts to people's life, to bring impacts to our community, city, and nation. Call to business is the call that God wants to place in my heart, and I do believe in also in your heart, business people, professionals, to be part of what God is doing in this last day. So I'm looking forward to inviting you all to join Call to Business. Some of the things in the scripture that encourage me in the marketplace calling, there's a lot of them actually, but one of them is the parable of the talents. And I look at that parable a lot different than it was taught to me most of my life. The parable of the talents is about a landowner who had he well, one of his lands to one of his train other people to do what he would, what he had done. So he gave one of his land one of his trainees five talents of gold or silver, which is around five hundred pounds. And the man went out immediately and invested it. What, you, what I'm talking about is what I believe God wants every one of us to go through. To understand our kingly and priestly role as a business leader. To understand our responsibility in our community and our responsibility to the world. So Call to Business is about that. We're about creating jobs, raising up workers that understand their responsibility in the marketplace to create wealth and raising up the kings and priests of the earth that, are real, that can actually have the ability and the calling to lead that. Rather than modeling after those business people in the Bible who are successful, we have example after example of businessmen and women who are extremely successful in their businesses and, and they never ever um, compromised on their walk. They never compromised on their faith. And yet, they were looked to for guidance, for counsel, for, for jobs, for opportunities, and for uh, comfort. And quite often, we have separated that. And it, we need to make a, an intentional decision to not do that and to start to transform who we are in the world. You have given us our freedom. Yeah, yeah.